big fatty gals, boys, and everything in between. Welcome to my very first episode of my very first pod, Antics with Ash. I'm so happy to have you guys here. Let's go. As you guys know, I have been in locked in. There is so much to unpack. So it was only right that this first episode be a locked in special. We're going to have lots of guests for you today. A little girly debrief. Kicking off with my gal dev sugars, <laughs> Casey J and Ten. Hi, babies. Hello. Hi. <laughs> um, you two back. look so hot and naughty. So do you. No, we came and we were like, Shit, No, <laughs> right. This was actually a narrative throughout the whole time. I am a hot girly and I like to dress hot. But I didn't think you meant like this. I thought you just meant like leggings. No. Or, so like, when we said hoochie balls. mama, we meant hoochie <laughs> yeah, mama. Really do. You really did. So being in tracksuits was like not my vibe, I must be honest. <laughs> it suits you though, but this, this suits you better. Yeah. Is, I agree. As Honestly, in, I'm I not mad in tracksuit, boots. I'm like, fuck, let me get my boots. <laughs> no, stop. Obviously, <laughs> Case, is reckon de- um, Case is rocking Devu, her <laughs> own brand, because she is literally it's, an it's entrepreneur. It's in my wardrobe, honestly. Is it really? <laughs> no, like... Stop. I don't think there's anything else in there. Your whole wardrobe is just David. Pretty much. You're such an icon. <laughs> anyway, right, girlies, um, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? What was your reception like after the show? Like, tell me, tell me. I feel overwhelmed. I feel like was the only word I could really use to describe mm. the feeling when you come out. Even when I got my phone, I didn't even go on it because I was like, I was like, how do I launch back into like the, the real world? Yeah. I was just messaging people like, yo fam, they thought I got hacked. <laughs> they were like calling my sister like, ten's been hacked because usually I'd be like, I'm out. You just like, put yo fam. I was fam. like, yo fam. <laughs> like, oh, I, I was so like, <laughs> yo fam. <laughs> yeah, like, you listen to Lydia. You, yeah, you haven't spoken like, to anyone like, for two weeks. Turn her into a man. Yeah, <laughs> so that like, is so funny. Did you get it? Did you get it? Did you get it? Did you get it? <laughs> so and then and then I didn't want to go on my phone and then I was like scared to like look at the videos because mm. I got the hate comment. I was like. I, I feel like I need to get home to read because I thought it was going to be so much hate. But yeah. then it was so overwhelming because it was literally like the complete opposite. So I had, it's been great since I've been out, to be honest. I'm so glad that you feel that. I felt the same way about my phone. As in, you yeah. only turned it on, you just heard, and no, I went, literally. nah, that. I was like, that is a sensory overload. I was 100%. like, not even. I feel like it. I forgot how to tie it. Like, you know, when you're cold and your phone doesn't work, I was like, Mate, she had work, uh, kid, like, yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> 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 I, when we were outside the house and we all finished, when I tell you I was holding my phone like a Nintendo DS, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> yeah. I, I could not. You know, like, mums on their phone yeah. where they're like, I oh, was itch like that as It well. was like that. I, it, I was being so weird. Like, the whole thing was so <laughs> strange. I couldn't wait to get home. And as soon as I pulled up, I was like, oh, I was like... <laughs> A bit like what underwhelming? Like, yeah, I was just yeah. Like, like, you won. Yeah, it is. Like, no, 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 she's like, oh, I don't even care to be I there. missed the sleepover. <laughs> I know, I know. The whole time, all I was going is, guys, it's just one big sleepover. And then I got home and I was like, oh, I just miss it now. I felt yeah. like I was like, I'm like, so I'm like, calm down. I was like, like you know, no, but it does feel like goes, that because it's like you get that adrenaline every day, mm. and then you just go back to like your normal life. You're like. I was like, oh my God, I've got nothing going on. Like, yeah. this is so boring. Yeah. yeah. I do like, feel... Like, where's the challenge area, guys? Yeah, yeah it feels like anticlimactic, doesn't it? Because everyone was like, oh my God, what are you going to do when you get out? And I was just in the Addison Lee home like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, I don't know, like, go to bed? Like, what yeah. Like, what do yeah. you mean, what am I going to do? I went do? out. Did you? You went and straight out? And got in and got ready. I had to do another <laughs> Makeup. You know, we were saying we never want to do makeup again. No. Nah. I've had to wear makeup ever since. Guys, when I say doing our makeup every day was genuinely hell and horror. Hell and horror. Hell and horror. Hell and horror. Like, it was us and it was all production being like, girls, 20 minutes. And we were all just like, oh. I felt like I put wet sand on my face. Yeah. It's like, you're yes. getting ready for like, to. If I was, th- that was normal life. I wouldn't put my makeup on for that. But because no. you know you're on camera and it's like, I've literally put a makeup on to stay in all day. And then it's like, you can't even lay properly. There was times yeah. I wanted to just, yeah, yeah. and I couldn't. <laughs> just, <laughs> just to grab that face no, and literally. rest. But it was like, oh, I don't want to. It was so, in- and we all felt like our skin was going to pot by the last day because we were just like, oh my God, we've done full like camera yeah. faces. Every single, it was just a lot. Oh. No, it was. Yeah. Anyway, so if there's anything we've learned from Locked In, <laughs> then I'm looking at you, it's that hot girls cry <laughs> and it's okay. Um, Ted, let's speak about your li- liquid emotion moment. <laughs> now I look back, I'm like, it was not that deep. Like, even no. in the comment, I'm like, it really wasn't deep. And 
the more I reflect, the more I'm like, I don't think I was crying about the comment. Mm. I think I was more crying about that everyone got a nice comment. And yeah. mine was last. And it was almost like, I was reading everyone's yeah, yeah, comments yeah, yeah. like this. Like, <laughs> yes, Ash. Like, yes, Casey. Like, yes, Joyce. Like, I was like, yeah, like cheering everyone. And, and then, then it mine was came just... and it was like, oh. Yeah. Stab me in the chair. I do think that was such a they violation. They put me in the middle. So yeah. Then everyone's nice comments gave me a bit of like serotonin and like made me get over it. But yeah. It was like mine. And then, all right, bye. Yeah, yeah. Everyone out of the, out of the living area. No, literally. We were off. And I was just like, I was like, I can't believe they've done that, bless her, because that is like to give. I thought they would do it that like one day everyone got a nice comment. That's what I and thought. And then like everyone no would get shitty comments. No one got a horrible comment after that. Probably because they thought I was on the edge. Well, of yeah, like, really you, were, you were. I was even talking to producer like, I just want to go home. I think it's my time done. No, so you were on the brink. Me. But they all got a horrible comment after that. But yeah, because they saw the damage that it did. <laughs> yeah, I know. Bless her. Yeah. No, it was actually breaking my heart. We wouldn't survive like Love Island or anything like that. <laughs> no. Do you not feel like, I feel like I've got such a newfound respect for, like, people that go on Love Because I always oh, used to watch it yeah. and think, oh, my God, nothing is this deep. Like, why are you all crying over this? You've known my man for two minutes. Like, how are you in love? Literally. But, like, I get it. Because all you have in there, you don't have any connection to the outside world. So, like... You have no entertainment either. Yeah, like, so that one comment people, was all you knew. And I didn't even know what it was too, yeah. So it was... So then you yeah, were like... Your emotions are so heightened. That yeah. If, before I left, if someone said to me, you need to put invitations for your wedding now in five years, I would have invited you all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One million percent. <laughs> like, these people are my... If I had a kid, someone would have been the godmother in there. Like, Who would be bridesmaid? Yeah. <laughs> one million percent. Yeah, like, that's how much you just feel so close. Yeah, it's so weird. Like, it made me think, God, I so have a respect for people that do any kind of reality show now. I could never go longer than, like... Like, Love Island is, like, what, two two months? Is it? I could never I do, do two months of that. That would make me want to die. Yeah. That is evil, too. It's months. insane. And, like, constant... Even... Did you feel but conscious about it? At least the... they were in the sun. Yeah, yeah fair. Talent, yeah. You know? And we yeah, were in fucking true. Cambridge. The freezing cold. <laughs> yeah. It was freezing in that house as well. It was so <laughs> cold. Um... Ten, did you feel like the reaction towards you changed? Because I feel like it so has from what I've read. But, like, obviously you were shitting yourself thinking the world hates me and thinks I'm a villain. So did you think it changed after that? Yeah, I don't think I necessarily changed because no. they don't really show it too much in the episodes, but there was always a time where, like, any time positive, I always made a negative comment. But it was just... I just <laughs> yeah, yeah, to be yeah, funny. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I didn't change the way I acted, but I just think... I think you do just have to get to know me. I'm not mm. someone that is, like, in first impressions likeable because I'm, I am a lot... <laughs> yeah, I'm not likeable. That is such a funny <laughs> self-assessment. <laughs> <laughs> On first impression, I get it. If you hate yeah. me, that's fine. I'm quite overwhelming. Or, like, I don't know. I just think I'm not likeable at the beginning. You do have to, like, mm. get to know me to realise that. I'm just joking. Like, yeah. I really am just joking. But I feel like yours as well was more like a protection thing. Yeah, but I didn't change. No, you know, I don't... understood me more. No, but, yeah. like, but I feel like... Because it's like... When you first, like, meet you, because you are quite, like... You're quite strong. Do you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you do get, like... It almost comes across, like, cold. Yeah, then it's like, yeah, then yeah, once yeah, I you get that. Like, no, you, you do realise, like... Yeah, I soften. I do soften up. You're actually just very sensitive. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> I'm actually so sensitive. You're such a real. fucking softie. I don't care what anyone says. I am. Um, I cried when George didn't get a call with his mum. Like, that wasn't normal. Like, don't. Anything could have been... <laughs> like, if, God forbid I knew Foo was crying that day. <laughs> I, <laughs> in the store, I had no mind. idea if Foo cried that day. I would have been... No, I wouldn't have had a good day. Do you remember when we got the nominees? We were like... Why is Phil up for crying? Yeah, because I was like, Lord knows I get it. I'm a sap. Like, yeah. I've been a wet lettuce every day. <laughs> yeah. But I was like, Phil, I've seen cry the one time that Stars left, which is valid. And I was like, has he cried? And then he just cried because your mum called you, didn't it? Yeah, but it was... Yeah, and they the showed us on the... Oh, don't. I and mean, then they showed us that clip and I was like... I didn't know he was Something crying to about that about a extent. man crying that upsets me so much. Because it's like men can't control their bottom lip when they cry. And it always goes... So, <laughs> like, that's me. When I cry, I'm such an ugly cryer because my bottom lip goes. No, honestly. No, but it, do you know what? I think it's so funny because that self-assessment that you have of yourself is not what I think at all. As in, really? I immediately was like, 10 is jokes. But I okay. think if you don't see the full scope of the day and you only see you Me going full like... full energy, yeah. Like, I don't... Yeah, or little eye rolls. Yeah, yeah, literally. Yeah, yeah. Then, of course, you'll be like, oh, Ten's not a team player or she's not getting involved. Yeah, but even... But the, you so were. I was, so, I was such a team player that 
I got annoyed at my own team because yeah, I yeah, wanted yeah, to win yeah. that bad. Yeah. But even there's a bit where I'm like to my team, I'm like, you done shit, you done shit. And people really thought I was genuinely being like, yeah. oh, a piece of shit, like, you done shit. Like, <laughs> Which is so funny because to us... we done shit. Yeah, but to us, that's just you being jokes and we were all finding it funny. Yeah. So it's yeah. so funny how things translate so differently, like, when they come out and 100%. in the edit. But people don't get sarcasm as well. Like... Agreed. I found that like online people do thing. not get sarcasm. Yes, like, it is. Stuff doesn't deliver in the right way. I don't yeah, think. No. Half of my jokes, I was looking at them and I was like, nah, nah, that did not land no, in the way I did it to. landed. I don't think you they landed. The what, way watching you... it back? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Some of them, I was I like, you're hilarious. don't know. I think you're absolutely <laughs> no, hilarious. The yeah. way you deliver it is the, really? what's so funny. Like, the thing you said about George's farts. Oh, oh yeah, fair. Hilarious. That was jokes. Oh, I'm okay. No. I'm glad. Okay. <laughs> that Girlies, was it, got though. my back. Yeah, yeah. That was, that was the that only one. line you were shit for the rest of the time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. Um, what I wanted to chat to you about as well, Ten, is you did a little reaction vid with Casey's parents. Yeah. About your eviction, which obviously was like, I thought that eviction was so hard. Like, that was the worst thing ever. Yeah. And obviously, you watching it back, like, how did you feel? Like, do you get why Joyce made the choice that she made? Like, yeah, no, how do you feel about it? I get the choice because I do... I Even I said, like, mm. I don't think I deserve it more than food. So right. in that terms of thing, I understood it. But I think it was more the shock because mm. I gave it the... Um, he doesn't deserve it more, thinking that I wasn't going to go. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought, like, three girls, two boys. I thought, let me let me end it. Let me let you go, Foo, with a yeah, nice yeah. wholesome... You do your wholesome anecdote, because yeah. low-key, I'm staying. Yeah, yeah, that's like, what I time. thought. So I think it was more the shock that yeah. made me... And then, like, also, I feel like it made me feel more like, was it that, was it that? Because co you just don't read comments. No. Because they were getting into my head more of, like, that. that's so out of order, that's so out of yeah. order. But... I understand it. Like, I really do understand it. Mm -hmm. And then it was when I came out, I found out I wasn't even in the bottom two. So I star got the immunity. So then I was uh, even more like, was like... Yeah, I was even more gutted after that because I was like... Because that's not even like a valid eviction then. Cause yeah, it's just because, like, because it was like star and food. But then, right. So then after that, I was more like, are you joking? <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, like, get me home in that house. Yeah, fair. But I think I left at a good time because I left off with, like, so much love. And, like, mm. who knows, if I'd stayed that extra four days, maybe I would have got cancelled or, like, done something, like, crazy. <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? like, yeah. I always, like, think that everything happens for a good reason. I agree. And the good reason is maybe I would have done... Or maybe mm. I would have gone crazy, like, the mm. extra four days. So yeah. everything works out in the end. I'm not going to lie. I found it so hard. Like, uh, the few days after you left... I was like, this is getting really hard now. Just it like, like being stuck was in this house. Hell and yeah. horror. Yeah. <laughs> no. Our new favourite phrase is hell and no, horror, by the way. People like, you can just tell Casey's really struggling about telling. I'm just sitting on the sofa like... <laughs> Don't, yeah. I'm like, bro, I am just daydreaming. Like, <laughs> Speaking of, that clip of you like this... As in, you I'm have to take up one. ribbons professionally, <laughs> first of all. No, my mum was more, she was like, wow, you really don't have a talent, do you? Is that what she said? She, she can do the recorder, like, you know, she learned it in, like, primary school or some shit, like, you know how, like, George did the recorder? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and so she was like, wow, you actually have no talent. Do you know what, that pisses me off, though, because I feel like the recorder is one of those instruments that everyone says, yeah, yeah, I play that. No, she showed and me. And nobody plays it. it, it. She showed me, yeah, she did the EastEnders, like, theme tune, yeah, she did about three seconds, it was like, see? Yeah, it's like, like bro, in the no. My ribbons were so much better than that. I, yeah, I think your ribbons were unbelievable. But they cut it down so much, and I'm so glad they did. Because I was watching it like, like I'm watching it like this, because I don't want to see it. Do you know what? It was and the bit where you stacked so it. Oh, my God. It killed me. I was in... I didn't know you stacked no. it that bad, because I heard you fall, but I was upstairs. Because I came up and told you, and then yeah. you didn't realise it was an actual, like... It was a full stack. Like, it was you a slide yourself? and drop. Yeah, it was yeah. a slide and drop. Snapped my nail. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was, was so it, like, funny. You had an injury as well. I snapped my I nail. Snapped my, that was what snapped my nail. Is that what snapped like, my nail? <laughs> I was like, By the way, and please. And then I put my shoe on after. I was like, ooh. <laughs> Look at me, look at the state of me and Ted. This is the epitome of what locked in's done to us. <laughs> I've got, had that yeah. since. Have you still got that one like, that one gone as well? Because it's it snapped like down here, but I can't get it off because it's still like attached to no. the skin. So I can't even put one on top because it's like crap. I need mine done so bad, it's actually hell. Um 
10, where did the narrative of you and Danny come from? Oh my God. Because I'm so baffed at it. Because that was not the case in the house. Like, no, at, at any wasn't. point did we say that? No, no one said it. But do you know what I think it is? I was like that with everyone in the house. Yeah. I, like, trolled every single person. Yeah. Constantly, I was just winding... Ev I winded everyone up. Mm -hmm. No one didn't get it. Even you got it that day when I put salt in your cup. <laughs> everyone got it. So then, it wasn't like a thing. It was me and Danny constantly had this, like, jokey, like, hitting each other. But yeah. they just showed it, like, more with me and Danny, I guess. Mm -hmm. They that's So then people just cling on to it and, like, made it... And then when I said that I would hook up with him out of everyone in the house. One I million said, no, I didn't say him at first. I said Ash. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. I said oh, Ash. Oh, yeah. And they were like, you have to pick a boy. You have to pick a boy. You have to yeah, pick you a boy. Oh, my God. Yeah, her. So I actually forgot yeah. about that. Boy. She was like, you can't pick a girl. So I was like, cool. Danny, like... Because he's just the sweetest. Yeah, well, yeah. But then I think that's what, like, then made it into, like, a we like each other and all this, but... Yeah, and then people just clutch, though, onto any narrative. They're like... As in, like, Danny and Tennessee, like, actual yeah. fan accounts. There's, like, no love way. accounts where they've yeah. put, like, like, romantic music behind them. And it's just, like, Shut clips of those up. two shadow boxing. And I'm like, this is <laughs> one of the worst things I've ever seen. <laughs> because it's just, like... I had to say on the one I did with your parents as well, I was like, it was like a brother and sister, like, relationship. Yeah. It was never... And I think a lot of people think Danny was like that of all of us, but it was genuinely like more of a brother. Like when he would come and give Agreed. us hugs, it was so like a yeah. brother way that I mm -hmm. didn't even like think in my and head that's it the was thing, in you that You don't way. see it like that and you don't even like, you'll just do something and you don't think about it and then you come out and you're like, yeah. you can see everyone taking the wrong way, but like still. When like, you're in there. But like, he was like that of everyone. Like it wasn't like He was any literally so way, affectionate like, to all of us because he just is that guy. Like. Yeah. People took the clip as well when I run and jump up on him. Yes. And I'm like... No. And now everyone's like, oh, this their relationship. And I was like, this is absolutely sending yeah. me. The way that everyone like manipulates things. But I also think it was made worse by the day that we all lost the plot and said that he was sexy. Oh my God, yeah. <laughs> I've seen that clip so many times as well. As in, it's like all the girls have a crush on Danny. <laughs> Yeah, the fact that that's the opening line is yeah, so... No, Tennessee admits she's attracted to Danny. Like, yeah. That was actually the name of the video, but... Yeah, I mean, that was the second time you said it, so... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> you made your own <laughs> Yeah, but the thing is, right, not being funny, we had had no single male interaction for ages by that... As in, I would have fancied a Cocker Spaniel at that point. It, like, honestly. So I just feel like we lost the plot a little bit that yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, we did, we did. No, honestly. Uh, Case, let's chat to you. How does it feel to be a winner, winner chicken dinner? Feels... <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> you just hate chatting about it, don't you? No, it's just so awkward, but... No, I'm happy... Because the thing is, I was saying, like, when I first went in, like, mm. I literally... It's so cringe, but I, like, filmed... I filmed a video to myself before I went in. Just, like, literally... No, this is so cringe, but just, like, one minute, because I was just, like... You know, I was, like, I want to see what I was thinking before, because mm. you don't remember what you think before you went in. Just, like, things like, this is how I feel, this is mm -hmm. what I think will happen, like, predictions more than anything... And I said in the video, I was like, I don't think I'll win or anything. And then, and so I had no intention. Like, when they asked me what I'd do with the money, I was like, mm. I don't know, like, I'm going travelling, she's sat. Right. And then when I was, like, getting closer and closer to the final, and I was like, wait, there's actually a chance? Like, and then, and then I had We the all knew from day dark. It. We were like, <laughs> Casey J is winning this thing. But then as soon like, as I knew, like, I was like, oh, I want to give the money for Nan and Grandad. It gave me, like, an incentive. Mm. So I was literally, like, every night, I'm like, if there's any God up there, yeah, like, do you know what I mean? Like, I'm just, Don't. like, manifesting. Yeah. And so when I won, I was like, it just had, like, all that excitement mm -hmm. and stuff. And, like, yeah. That's so weird. What did you say in that video to yourself, like, of how you thought it would be? It did, was I just it said, like... How you ended up, like, how it ended up Well, being? I said, I was like, I'm nervous, but I also know that, like, I'm going to try not overthink, because I know that once I'm in there, like, I'll enjoy it kind of mm. thing. Because, like, I spoke to previous people that went on it, and they said, like, literally, you'll love it. Mm -hmm. So I was like, there's no worry for, there's no reason for me to worry. Because, yeah. And then I just... I said that I was most scared for the... You know the Rose Battle Challenge? Oh, yeah. And it never even and came the, up. It, so the, every single day, I'm like, please don't be You there. said that please every day. day. Yeah. And it never came up. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah, she, she woke up like, she was like, I wonder if today will be the roast battle challenge. That's <laughs> 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 The way I can imagine you going through bars in your head every night, like, 
<laughs> yeah, before I came up, before I went in, I was thinking, okay, if I get this person, I'm going to say this, this, this. And yeah, 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 yeah. You're like, look, yeah, I was even fight? reassuring her before. I was like, hopefully you can get me then. She's and like, I'll give you, you your say. Right, right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You could effectively out, roast like, everyone. <laughs> because they told me there was going to be one because I was like, look, I was like, I'm so nervous for it. Can I be like the host so I don't have to do it? And the they're host. like, oh, we're going to get a surprise host for it, yeah? So I was like, okay, so it's definitely coming. And it never came. And it never came. I wonder why but they I did was that. Like, you know what? Do they do I'm that every year? Yeah. Oh, I don't know why that happened. They could Maybe have done the it host cancelled and they put us in that red box. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the cardboard box. Bro, we the have to red sit in. box. Can I just say, any challenge that's like that drives me round the bend. Like, I like challenges that are like, even the dog thing, like, I know, Case, actually, to be fair, that was your worst nightmare. But it's still, though, it was a day out. A day out, a bit <laughs> of a trend. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was. You were rocket, rocket running from that. I couldn't <laughs> believe it. She was, was so small that I stood out, it was going to eat you up. Your Bro. head would have gone missing any minute in that suit. But you just was like, go for it. Bro, like, you do you know so what hot. was the worst? <laughs> what do you think? Yes. <laughs> I'm basically, before, right, in my head, I was like, I am you so bold. I was like, <laughs> I am going to be so lit that everyone's going to be blown away. And then they put the suit on me and it was like wearing a brick shit house. Like it was so heavy. And I was like, oh my God, I can't. I'm not going to get yeah, past one. Heavy. Did you find it that heavy? Yeah, it was so heavy. It was, and I couldn't move my limbs. And I was like, oh my God, I'm fucked. Like this dog is going to maul me. You did me. good. What did you get at the end? I can't remember. I got five. Fuck you! <laughs> you got two. two. I was fighting for three though. Well. I got two. You know our team was meant to win. They did. They, what do you mean? No, you wasn't. No, they were adding it up they on from the, the beginning. Why? They did the points wrong. No, they were adding it on wrong from the beginning. So on, the, on the screen, yeah, because on the screen where they were adding it up wrong from the beginning, then at the end, I was like, "You've lot have added it up wrong from the beginning," but then they didn't do that in the episode because all the comments were like, oh. one." Because oh, what? The, t- the points came up on screen, yeah, and it was like, we had 10, they had 11, then I got the two points, which would have taken us to 12, but the points just never went up, so we just stayed on 10. So actually, we were, I think no, we were no, meant to win. No, they, I had this argument with, with the Yeah, 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 no, no, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I, I looked at it. But in the moment, you go, yeah, where and them. Yeah, but, <laughs> but they haven't... The, the, 10's favourite phrase was... Play back like, the VR. Wheel back the VR. And she was standing there at that phone like I, slow mo. I become the worker on that mission. You were part of production. I was watching every video. Shannon's one. It got really serious because I was like, "That is a two. They were like, "We no." I was like, "That's a one." They were like, "It's a two. And I was a felt like deep because like Shannon was like over there, and I was like, Shannon said, just being mauled by a dog, and you're like, "Nah, man." Like, watch it back. Like, even at that point, I was like slow mo in it. Yeah, yours is the only one where I didn't. I let them give you the two. I do think you deserve. Thanks. But I was like, I'm not even going to argue Casey's one. I did like, get two. Like at all. I got two. No, that whole even, thing. Like, stars, I was trying to get stars the five. It was just so long that he fell into five. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. As in, I feel like stars could have just done that at four <laughs> yeah. and he would have gone into five because <laughs> yeah, yeah. he's a BFG. Yeah, literally. I took that too seriously. Looking back, it was just a bit of fun. Like, it was you know, a, like, yeah. The whole thing was a bit of fun. I really did take some of the challenges. Like, No, because uh, it's all you have. <laughs> Just for a takeaway. Yeah, just yeah. for a takeaway. All, 10 boxes of chocolates. All for a greasy Indian. It's actually oh peak. It's so peak. But yeah, I just feel like challenges like the red box for me, the staying in the boxes and just being like, oh, who knows? They Get out whenever out you want. so much in that challenge. You know how... You know, remember they said to me, so I fell asleep in the box. And remember I said I had that dream yes. that I fell down the stairs and I flinched. And then the production said to me, you said in your sleep, oh my God, I've just fallen down the stairs and died. Yeah. But it wasn't in there. Did they not put that in there? They didn't put it in there. I the thought that would have been gold. The was about like, it was each about five minutes. It was like, it was like sped up. Then it was like Danny and George walking around. Then it was like a few bits of dialogue. Sped up, bit of dialogue. Sped up, you jump out, I jump yeah. out, everyone jumps out. And then everyone jumped out, like, one like, after another. It was another. like, 10 minutes, and I was like... Yeah, basically, for context, Casey had a whole nightmare <laughs> in that box. <laughs> as in, she slept, she woke up, she had a meal. Like, she went through a whole day in that box. No, I really flinched, because I, I literally... It was, it was the dream that I was in the <laughs> locked-in house, and I used to slide down the balances like this, and in my head, went from the top, bounce to the bottom. And then she woke up in her and box, I and she went... And talked as well. <laughs> and they that so funny. That's so funny. I, I know. I don't know why they... I'm not they... for it, actually. 
I feel like there's so much that I think I remember as funny moments that just were not yeah. in the edit. And I was like, even um, the talent show day, I was like, there was so much on this day that was jokes. You know, like when we were practicing, yeah. mm-hmm. you tried out like three different things before yeah. saying, I don't want to do it. <laughs> I was like five different talents. <laughs> yeah. Like before, yeah. Even you see me writing for about 20 minutes of the thing and it's like, yeah. there's no one oh, thing, yeah. why is she writing so much? <laughs> Did they put that in? Because 10 no. killed me. She had multiple different <laughs> talents all in her pocket. And, she, and I went, 10, what are you going to do? She went, I'll just like decide in the heat of the moment. <laughs> so she got up. Did, did they show this? Because uh, you no, got on, you got, I say on stage, so sure. in the challenge room. You got in the challenge room and you picked out one thing and you went, oh, that was my first idea. <laughs> <laughs> I literally had plan B and plan yeah. like A. Like, and I don't know why think. they didn't show that because that's so funny. There were so many like, old but gold moments yeah that I'm like that was so funny but then I'm like was we finding it funny because we were down bad like agreed that, and true. it weren't that funny That's to true. watch agreed yeah but there were so many moments I was like how could they not even like there wasn't a moment of every single day where nice. I Wait, didn't look at you <laughs> We oh, just said you get it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I can move up the tad bit more. Do you get? How how long are we doing it for? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> can we just do one of us all doing this? Sorry, was. I love them so much. Also, I love, stars. I love, star, I love them so much. <laughs> stars dressing like Chris Brown every day is my favourite thing in the world. Yeah, me too. <laughs> When I saw him in his, like, out-of, locked-in clothes, I was like, nah, nah. <laughs> Cap turned to the side, full, bright blue tracksuit. He was, like, out of a 90s know, R&B music. Okay. He really was. I've never seen anything like it. He was in Step Up. He, he, yeah, he, he was in Step Up. <laughs> <laughs> he was. He actually yeah, was. He actually now you all come in and got that boost again. Yeah. I know. I feel... <laughs> I feel alive. <laughs> it's just nostalgic, guys. <laughs> I actually love it. Um, Case, everyone, like, the whole general narrative, I feel like, has been that you came in as this, like, shy girly, Honestly, and then you I left. I I got a tenor every time I've heard. Mate, like, it's actually this, mad. It's narrative because I would be rich. Like. <laughs> Honestly, do you think that, like, what do you think it was that made that happen? Was it the people? Was it just, like, getting a bit more comfy as the days went on? Like, what do you think it was? Because you were, I mean, you were so quiet day one and two. Yeah. Like, like don't, was, did you think that? Because obviously you knew like, each other before. I felt before. awkward as well. You were more quiet, but like I was talking to you, Dave. Well, not you, you wasn't talking to anyone, but you was. You definitely <laughs> you got louder and louder. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did you just say a word? Dave? You just mime. Thought, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 no, but yeah, she. I knew, like, I did think you were shy, but I didn't know you could get as like confident as loud as you did mm. get. Even oh, you shot. Thought, you thought I reached my limit. <laughs> yeah, like, I just she thought, thought you were, you were at quiet. your peak already. Um, yeah. Yeah. Limit, she I was like, you were a quiet yeah. person. Yeah, this I was saying to your parents, I was like, I knew probably that it would take time for you to get a bit more, but you you exceeded my expectations <laughs> of like yeah. how confident and like loud you can be and like mm-hmm. just bubbly and just, yeah, all of them things. I think it was, I just know that I can be like that around people I'm comfortable with. Yeah. So I think it was like a bit of both. It was like, it was the people in there and, like, because everyone's just, like, you just feel comfortable around everyone. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Like, everyone is genuinely so nice and, like... They just yeah. become, like, your little family, don't no, they? Literally. They actually really but do. But also because in that, like, environment and, like, that absolute social experiment, mm. you're just forced to come up. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you just get to, like, uh, like, what's the word? You get comfortable around people, like, really quickly mm-hmm. because everything in there is, like, intensified. So you, you know, like get to know people, like, mm-hmm. so quickly. So, yeah. I think it was that. But, like, say if I'd all just, like, met you and we went out sometime and, like, we met every other week, it would take longer. But yeah. in there, it's, like, by day five. Yeah, we've already been on 30 <laughs> like, nights out together. So, it's fine. Like, it's, that is, yeah. Like, that's how it is in Because I even kept saying, you've actually really shocked me, even, like... I didn't know you were this like little menace and like like I loved it. Like, it by did, the it end, it did come a bit from mafia. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Bro, that th- game. that's another thing that I'm pissed off that didn't make the edit. Our nighttime oh, no. antics, guys. If I could tell you 
the tomfooleries that happened after dark. <laughs> These two were the major culprits. I just used to sit and watch because I just thought, I don't want pasta sauce on my pillow tonight. Like, that's it. So I just used to crease and As watch that, all of it. you ever would have done that? <laughs> yeah. like, we you might say have that. taken your pillow. Yeah, what? yeah, I know. It is. And yeah, the reality is nobody actually, it was all mouth that's and no I, action. But that was the best part because you're then just like going to sleep like... Yeah. It's when I put Where the like of sweet one corn eye stuff, open when I'm sleeping. Literally. <laughs> Would you, oh my when God, I the put sweet the, corn. And Casey was like, no, let's open the sweet corn. And I was like, that's too far, Casey. That's too far. <laughs> yeah, she was, she <laughs> was, I was already creasing enough out of tin in someone's bed. Yeah. But she we was, were all finding it like, so funny. If you funny. pour it in, He's not going to notice. He's going to go sleep and then he's just going to... Yeah, she was like, let's half open them. So when he lays down, he squidges them out. I was like, that is... That is this is what I mean. Sleep. You are a night terror. You yeah, she are. Was, you were a night terror. It like. is so funny. Because basically, stars, for anyone that doesn't know, stars had a phobia of sweet corn, <laughs> which I have... Honestly, think is the most left phobia I've ever come across. You know, that's As the in, first thing I've ever heard. Like that's the first time I've ever heard someone being scared of sweet corn. Me too, but to the point <laughs> where that's why all you needed to do was get the unopened can <laughs> to about there, and you go, "No, we'll lie, allow, allow it." Did that too. <laughs> we'll lie, allow it. I was like, "What?" It was yeah. kidding me. And I'm so sad that none of that made the edit. It. I know. Even like the taking people's beds out. The like on. They cut out when me and Watson took Fu's bed and put it outside. And made the bed perfectly, as in they actually <laughs> made the bed they even in put the, the garden. Bedside, no, they put the thing outside as the bedside table yeah. and put like a cup on it. But none of that was in. And that was, for me, like the funniest moment. Same. I would that be going so to funny. sleep. Cracking and, yeah, up. And as I was like going yeah. to sleep, I'd be like... Yeah. No, and then I watched um, my parents went on Joe and George's podcast, but it was just Joe because we were in lockdown mm. at the time. And Joe was like, oh, I heard, like, um, someone put Foo's bed outside in the pouring rain. <laughs> what? In it the pouring... It was under a show-off. Oh, right, yeah. And he, was like, and he was like, and this I is heard what Chinese... he was, like, fuming, like... No. This is what Chinese whiskey does, see? Foo deserves anything he got at, at the night time. One million percent. At times a hundred. Everyone said he, like, <laughs> started it off. Foo, this is the thing with Foo, he started it off... And he got his little minions. He he created a war and then stepped back and just went like that. Yeah. <laughs> just watched and then it just honestly slow. retreated into his duvet and went, ha, 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 got them. <laughs> yeah. That's it. And we were just that like, was... you have started a whole war <laughs> that tonight. Was got, them. got them. <laughs> got them. Got them. But he's like, oh, they've gone out the room. You grab their mattress. So you do it. Why would we do it? I don't know. No, and master then, manipulator. And then they, them come, they come for you. It's like, wait, but this was Foo's idea, so why are we not all just ganging up and going to him? Yeah, yeah. I don't get it. It was always Foo's idea. It That's always. the whole of the story. Even one day, Danny figured it out, and Danny looked like he was in complete shock. He was like, Foo, like, if you're telling me that you've been behind some of this, <laughs> <laughs> what I'm going to do is like, you're don't one of the boys. Don't break like that. You can't do this. And this I was like, I mean. yeah, Danny, like, he's, he told us to take George's bed, bedding off. <laughs> <laughs> like to anyone else, this all must sound so stupid. And just like, how is that even funny? But it's yeah. like watch. It's like knowing you took their bed off and then watching them redo their bed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then watching thing. them find out, come into the living room, be like, nah, like, <laughs> who was it? And we're all like, like just dying. <laughs> it was actually so stupid. I'm sad that some of that didn't make it in. Yeah, I feel too. like it'll be like because they do an unseen bit. Yeah, so you know, you know, in the um, is like yeah. five unseen episodes of unseen. <laughs> this semi final, they cut out our paintings. So it's just the morning, and it cuts to just paintings on the table. They didn't put the paintings in. They didn't put the paintings in. So there's just portraits of us on the table. I <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no painting. <laughs> Just off it and I the just table. oh my god and the fact and that they I literally going in unseen bits but I'm like but that makes no sense of now there's like no context to why we all have these paintings there's like, a lot of things and we walk out of the final like well it's been good with our paintings like oh and they had the, those clips they have all the yeah but that's in the final isn't it right that makes no sense <laughs> ah, sister, sister. Oh, sorry to crash on the building oh baby oh, okay you lot are hoochie oh, yeah, yeah, hoochie yeah. 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 Good face. Hello. Oh my God, look at you. Um, okay, guys, to round off, I want to do a little round of Snog, Marry, Avoid with all the boys and you can't lie. Okay, I'm going to do it too. Ready? Um, I'm Marry Danny. Yeah. Snog fair. George. Yeah. Avoid Watson. Okay, facts. Yeah. 
Oh, um, <laughs> um, I'd have to say Snog George because I feel like Pooh and Stars are just too often. Like, I feel yeah. like it would just yeah, be yeah. weird. That's just a bit nancy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Marry Danny. Yeah. Just because he is a sweetheart. Yeah. Um, and then avoid Watson. I'm so sorry, but Fum and Star's my best mate, so. Yeah, fair. Yeah, oh. like, I'm so sorry, Watson. Well, I would also marry, like, Stars or Fum, to be fair. Agreed. In, a, like, a, just a friend marry way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is another game where you've got pick. Yeah, you're not. Okay, really. really. call cool, Danny. I'll just marry Danny. It's okay, fine. I would. <sighs> I think I would also marry Danny. God, honestly, we're, we, we're, we're, we're just keeping the edit. flames going on this narrative. <laughs> like, why is that edit? Like, why? I know. And then I think... I... Do you know what? I would snog stars just because I think he's such a gorgeous boy and I love him. Like, it's giving brother, so it's a bit weird, but... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that. <laughs> and, the, and I would avoid George. Reason being is his arsehole. I can't do it. Oh, okay. I, I can't spend the rest also, of my life with someone too farting. Much like an actual brother to you, so that would yeah, be Yeah, exactly. That's like weird, weird. weird. Yeah. So avoid George because incest and his horrible arsehole. <laughs> <laughs> 100%. Yeah. Great. Um, girls, I love you both. Thank hey, you. Thanks for having us. Congrats on your pod. Oh, congrats on winning, bud. <laughs> I love you. And you. Well, you lost. Yeah. <laughs> On not getting Fine, to yeah. <laughs> yeah, in it. Okay, guys, now we are going to introduce my hot, naughty, cool, sexy sisters, Shannon and Madame Jo. <laughs> my girlies, how are you feeling? Yeah, oh, good. Insane. I'm so happy to be here. Babe, yeah. can I just say, Joyce has come in, dripped out to the night. <laughs> the Givenchy bag just in the corner, product placement. Mm -hmm. no, 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 no. <laughs> It's a casual day. I literally just placed it. It's a casual, like, casual day. day. It's a casual day. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen you in track suits for the past two weeks, and then you come in like this. Honestly, can this we, is our aesthetic, fuck? though. This, this is, is what actually how, This is yeah. actually how I dress on a normal day. Yeah. So coming in and having to wear track suits every day, the way the, the minimum they could have done was given us some sort of you know leggings, feminine. <laughs> they said no, we gonna put you in those jogging bottoms every today. morning. Not me, they didn't. We were, but yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in it, you <laughs> were, you were the gym girl aesthetic and yeah. I was so jealous so every jelly. day. I don't feel like I deserved it. You I deserved did. it. No, you, you looked deserved sexy. it. No, you looked good. Your you buddy looked good. Your buddy looked good. Your buddy looked nice. Nice and tight. <laughs> yeah. Nice and tight, girl. Every day when the rail come, just to give you guys some context, it was like roulette. As in, mm. it was like, it would come and you'd be like, I don't know what I'm going to get today. Every day I'm looking at Shannon's hangers, <laughs> batty leggings, tighting. Tight and I'm looking at mine and it's just, yeah, joggers, joggers. oversized t-shirt. Jumpers. Yeah. I'm like, bro, I'm four foot 11. What are you trying to do to me? Yeah. And the thing is, I know it. I know Foot Asylum have that in their locker. Yeah. It's not as if they don't have the sexy, naughty fit. So I was like, give me the catalogue, blood club. We tried to make it work. Ash always was like, she'd have a big jumper and then she'd like, tie it with it a band. Yeah. Like, I'm with them with a the hairband. No, me like, every morning, guys. No bra. Titties live yeah. direct. Can you, can you just pull this up for me? I'd tuck it under. Oh my. I was doing origami every One day. One thing about yeah. Ash, you go see those nipples. <laughs> They yes. came in and said, they nipples. literally had to come in and say, sorry, <laughs> we're going to get demonetised. You've Guys, got to put your nipples away. I forgot about that. <laughs> so basically, what I'm screaming, one day production legit came in and said, girls, um, it, was, it was so like PG the way that they put it. Yeah. So like, they, they, were, they were airing on the side of caution. They were like, how do we deliver this? Girls, do you all have bras? <laughs> We went, you what? Oh, I went, no. What's Don't, that? What's that? <laughs> next, day, next day they came in and said, you've got to tell Joyce, for asylum, don't stock bras. That. <laughs> Yeah, what I was do like, you mean? Said, Give me the bra. They said they yeah. don't stock them. But yeah. I said that's a you problem. <laughs> yeah, let <laughs> the nipples fly then. Agreed. Yeah, because we just all wanted to be sexy and naughty. Yeah, but they were like, no, we like, can't no. monetize this no. on YouTube because all of your nipples. Your, uh, and obviously, it's freezing cold <laughs> in Cambridge. Yeah. This is a dumb yeah. island. Exactly. Like we're not in Saint Tropez, <laughs> yeah. so we're like this is every challenge. <laughs> we'd go, we'd go, to, we'd go outside and chill and have a talk, and we'd come out to the challenge area, and the breeze are like. <laughs> <laughs> The nipples are like... <laughs> oh, my God. Everyone's, you know me? everyone's nips were like this. Yeah, but I yeah. do look back at some of the pictures that Tom Holland took, though, and I think... <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. Think, oh, bless. Like, yeah, I do. I see it now. Yeah. The nips were nipping. For those who don't know, Tom Holland was the photographer that came <laughs> Yeah, day. I just assume. I just assume and really. he looked, he was. He is Tom Holland's doppelganger. Yeah. The spitting image. So we just called him Tom Holland. Yeah. Which, I think, which is actually a bit rude. He called me Sharon. <laughs> no, but... Fair. He did. Yeah, he Let did. And then the that narrative. Was that was your producer name. Yeah. Yes. Sharon and then the narrative producer. for the rest of the show was Shannon was Sharon. Yeah. The secret producer. <laughs> yeah. The secret producer. Yeah. <laughs> So, girlies, I want to know, how are you feeling upon getting out? What have the reactions been like? Like, just talk to me. Do you want to go first? Honestly, when I left that house... Sorry. That's okay, sister. <laughs> when I, I left that house, I was... I was so happy to see the outside world. Mm -hmm. I feel like people don't realise being in a mm -hmm. house for two weeks, no contact with the world, yeah. no awareness of social media, no awareness of your family and friends mm -hmm. is the most mentally challenging thing I've ever had to do. Yeah. So I feel like even before I got my phone, when um, they announced the, the winners and we all, um, I got a, I got a victim, mm -hmm. just to step out and to see the world was the most overwhelming yeah. feeling. I was I was so happy. And obviously now being in, in real life, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm so, so happy. I see my friends. I get mm -hmm. to chat to you guys mm -hmm. outside of the house. Honestly, it's been incredible. Mm -hmm. I, I, I definitely missed real life. One mm -hmm. million percent. Yeah, same. I mean, I came out and you just like, you literally see, <laughs> in the camera you see and you go, <sighs> yeah. <laughs> the sigh breathe. of relief. Yeah, oh like, my literally God. breathe. Yeah. But I come out, there's been like, you know, Chandler Bing's dead. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. What, what's that about? Why did nobody tell me that? I got back to a text from my mate with just Chandler's dead. I said, bro, what don't do fuck? me like that. Hello, how was locked in? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> some sort, dead. some yeah. sort of intro before just telling me Not that. bad news already. Babe, yeah. I said, oh, welcome to the cruel world. Like, welcome back. Right? Honestly. There was a hurricane in Jersey where I'm from. That, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, Sharon <laughs> is also a news reporter. <laughs> Don't kill me. But yeah, I was saying to Ten in Case just now, I have a newfound respect for anybody that does reality. Totally. Because Two I... Two or three months people are in there. Bro, no way. Two or three months. shocked me. I feel like just doing the two weeks here, mm -hmm. then coming to the realisation there are shows where people are locked in for two months, three months. Mm -hmm. Girl, Nella Rose is about to do... So look, I'm, I'm a slam. Get me out of her. I don't know how my good sister is going to even do that because those no. two weeks, I nearly died. Yeah. yeah. I nearly died. And I was in a nice house talking about outside with the leaves and the grass. And yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We were getting lunch brought to us. And yeah. she's... Whipping up a meal right. every night. Yeah. And yeah. we were down bad with that. Yeah. To think about her in the Wild West with crickets and all sorts. And cockroaches. I don't no. think crickets are her biggest worry. Uh, fair. It's Australia. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. All right, big blood cart pipes then. <laughs> have, you seen, have you not seen that video where the, where the kangaroo... Where the kangaroo ne nearly beat up that man in the water. Oh, yeah. Like this. He's like, fucking yeah. standing the on his two legs. Yeah. The hench kangaroo. Fucking, yeah. He has gone gym for nine months. Nine like months. I've never seen anything like nine, it. He's not that's... skipped chest day, has he? No, not at all. Not at all. Not, at all. not, not at all. one day. <laughs> so that's what... That, Nella Rose is going to go fight kangaroos out there. Yeah. 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 And I have so we much respect Fraser. for it. We had Fraser. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. yeah. Oh, Fraser. Oh, he was the best. Fraser. There's so many behind the scenes people that you guys don't know about. Yeah. That you just form such a bond with because it's all that's your only connection to the outside world like yeah. they're watching us as it's all happening yeah they're seeing how it's being received it's just such a weird feeling isn't it yeah. like people would come in from production to the yard and they were told to not talk to us they're meant to be incognito <laughs> literally guys they'd come into I the house that. to like fix something in the house they'd be like this <laughs> <laughs> so and all of us <laughs> Who are you? What's your name? And because honestly, talk to us. Yes. Yeah. Say something. Say something. No, they, didn't speak to, they didn't. They literally weren't speaking to us. No. no. It was so funny. And there was one guy in particular that always used to walk by and, and not say a word. He would purposely not make eye contact <laughs> with no one. Like he's like, go to the destination and the destination yeah. only. We're like, hello, speak. Right. Yeah. What's your name? And, and then we kept saying, oh, they're AI. Like yeah. they're not they even real people. Yeah, yeah. We've actually gone insane. We're imagining people. It is yeah. bad. Bad. It was insane. Okay, my sister. Talk to me. Let's, un let's unpack some shit. Let's go, man. I'm ready. Because I, when I tell you, I almost feel like I'm in real Jack Russell mode at the moment <laughs> with some of these shitty comments and some of the reception. And I can only 
put it down to the fact that in my head, you're carrying the show on your back. <laughs> like you've just had such great clips and so much time on screen that I'm like, do people just want to hate to hate? Yes. Because that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Every season, and you know what? It wasn't just me carrying. I think everybody on the show did absolutely mm -hmm. incredible. Mm -hmm. Like I have got the pleasure of meeting so many big and exciting personalities, you included, you included. Mm -hmm. So obviously, for some reason, um, I got quite a lot of screen time on the show, which mm -hmm. I'm again for asylum. I'm so thankful for, for for me to be able to put myself on the forefront. But the comments now, I just think that they they were insane. I'll be honest. Yeah. When I when I first came out and I and I saw the intensity of what people were saying, mm -hmm. I was a bit confused because I hadn't watched the show. But I think, so then you're thinking, what? What did I what, do? What, what, right. what, what did, did I show? Yeah. yeah. Did I show my bum? Yeah. Did I call someone a bitch? No, that was no, Star. Star. Yeah, that was Star. <laughs> yeah. Star did not stop showing his ass crack, let's be honest. Did yeah. I call someone a bitch? All these thoughts were going through my head and then I actually watched the show. Right. And I, and I felt like what, I did, did not warrant the level of hate. No. But then we have to remember, this is a show. People are mm. watching this for entertainment. And unfortunately, just like we watch on Love Island, just mm -hmm. like we watch on Big Brother, there's always somebody that people yeah. enjoy to, to be the um, antagonist. One million percent. And in this time, Ten already had her moment. Mm -hmm. so it started out as Ten. It started out as Ten. Started out as ten. Yeah. She had like a villain arc. Like yeah, she she yeah. thought she was a villain. And they were like, actually, we love Ten. We She's love real Ten. One. Yeah. Yeah. They're like, cool. Now we need somebody to, to really come at. Right. And, Unfortunately, it was me. But I'm looking at it and I'm like, I'm looking at the comments and I'm like, uh, they're quite empty comments. I'm annoying and this and yeah. that. Get around. Mm. But the passion did not match what I did. No. Mm -hmm. So I just took it as it's 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 TV, yeah. it's fun. As we all know, hate mm -hmm. spreads a lot more than love. Mm -hmm. So as much as people were hating me, I hate that it took away from you guys doing amazing mm -hmm. things because mm -hmm. bearing in mind, we were celebrating that you're in the final, Foo's in the final. Right. But I'm seeing you guys post and they're talking about how much they hate me. Yeah. I'm like, that's not, that's not what we're celebrating here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, it it's was sad. wild Yeah, it was me. wild. It was wild. But people just love to hate. Yeah. They, they love, love to, hate. to hate. And they pick a person, they go for it. Mm -hmm. That's it. And they, like, it's nothing you did. And realistically, people, you're loud and mm -hmm. you're funny. And you're a woman. <laughs> Let's talk about and it. And what are we going to say here? Say it again. Shall what say it louder say for the here? people in the back. If talk you, like that, they hate that. Yeah. yeah. And they hate that. And they're just, they're going to just grab onto that and hate it. I also think controversial opinion, but it's, very easy for boys to be loud, flamboyant, mm -hmm. to be a little bit mischievous. I mean, you can break shit. Yeah. And yeah, what, everyone's yeah. like, ha, 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 hilarious. <laughs> yeah. what, what, hilarious. Entertaining. The minute a girl does it, jarring, doing too much, get her out, get around, screen yeah. time, mm -hmm. like a whore for all the attention. And I'm like, what, why is there that, like, such a big gap in that? It's so annoying. Mm. I think what it is for me, I feel like, and again, there's a standard set for how women and men are supposed to act. Mm. On, 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 a, on a basis. Mm -hmm. So women are supposed to be quite dainty and feminine. Make and mild. And submissive. Who, and me? Yeah. I think me. any Not woman me. that contradicts that mm -hmm. is going to be attacked for it. And yeah. it's exactly what you said. But also loved for it. I there, mean, it also... There is, yeah. that you have to see that side. And yes, you always pay more attention to the negative comments. Everyone does. Yeah. You get like 50 good comments, you get one bad comment, You that bad comment will play in your head. Mm -hmm. But people also love a loud, funny girl. Yeah. Like that love is still there. Yeah, a thousand percent. And, and again, like Chan was saying, as much as we did get a lot of hate, I received so much love. Mm -hmm. So much love. Yeah. It was overwhelming. But I think sometimes in the noise, you just see, you just, like you said, you'll just focus One on the hate. One million percent. Yeah. But when I, do, when I do compare the amount of hate to the amount of love, I mm -hmm. have received a lot more love that I'm, I'm super, super grateful for. So yeah. 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 Right, babe. The girlies yeah. love it. The girlies. You know the girlies love it. They really they do. Love it. They, girl, they ate it up. Because and that's yeah. what's important. I think, I think guys... I think guys need to start hanging out with girls a bit more to know what we're really like. Honestly. I feel like it's a shock as for guys yeah. to see girls like me and you on camera. Mm -hmm. But when the girlies are looking at their friends, sisters, cousins, mm -hmm. we remind them of one of them. Yeah. We remind them of their friends. Mm -hmm. We remind them of their, mm -hmm. their boisterous uh, sister, mm -hmm. their um, eccentric cousin. Like yeah. There are so many women like us mm -hmm. on in real life, but on social media platforms and on TV were, were just regressed to how we look. Mm. Like, don't talk. Just as long as you're sexy, that's yeah. fine. So it's very weird for them, but I'm glad we were that representation, definitely. One million Not percent. Me. Yeah, I'm glad, yeah. 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 
also, Shan, so I feel like we had many conversations yeah. in the house yeah. where you were kind of like, this isn't the most natural environment for me. No, no it was totally unnatural. <laughs> okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Not, not look at me. I, I was just trying to make it <laughs> digestible. Yeah. She was like, babe, how, how it, was hell. Hell. it was It was, <laughs> it was hell. Yeah. But why do you think that was? Do you think that you needed, like, a moment to adjust to that environment and take it in and then really be yourself? Like, why do you think that was not immediately a space that you felt comfortable in? I feel like very intimidated, but I'm not like a loud, loud person. Mm. So when I'm surrounded by nine like loud people, it's not so much I'm intimidated, I'm just like, you do you. And yeah. like, <laughs> I will just let you do you. I'm mm -hmm. happy to like sit back, I'm a watch, I'm a watcher? That sounds weird, but like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, always I'm, watching. <laughs> always I'm observer. Thing. <laughs> I'm an observer. <laughs> like I like just to sit back and just like let you do your thing. Mm -hmm. But then when I'm like now, we're, we're obviously on camera and things like that and I'm with you guys and mm -hmm. I feel very comfortable with you guys now. Yeah. But like, it just takes me a while to feel comfortable around people. Mm -hmm. Of course. And I also like was... I look back on it like I was so ill when I was in there. Yes. Like, they don't know about the UTI. They don't, they don't even know. Babe. They don't know about yeah. the UTI. They don't know about Gary the medic. They, they don't know about Gary, Gary the, the medic. medic. Gary, Gary the medic <laughs> is overworked and underpaid. underpaid. Let me Preach tell you. It, yeah. So he was the medic that was like on call for all of our like needs. scrapes, bumps, needs, whatever we mm. needed. Like you need to have somebody there if people are getting ill. And they also like by the end, so many of us were getting ill. Yeah, I um, was cold. I needed cold and flus the last four I, days. She got bit. I got bit. We don't even know about that. They don't even know about the bite. Can, can we chat about that? Let's talk about. Let's talk about the bite. <laughs> Let's talk about the bite. Ah, yeah. So, the dog challenge, girl, girl. <laughs> Yeah. They let us get mauled by dogs for fun. I get and it. And then cut it. Yeah, I <laughs> get it. It's it. entertainment. It's a show. You need to bring some numbers in. My girl, just explain it, Joyce. Just explain it. Talk us I through it. Right, so you guys saw, you saw me running. You saw me falling. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I tripped and fell. I thought I was, honestly, before we got into the, the line... Before I started running, I was trying to manifest Usain Bolt, mm. Usain Bolt, Usain Bolt. It's exactly because what I said I just now. <laughs> so I'm literally sprinting, and as mm. I sprint, this suit is so heavy. Oh, it is, it's so it's heavy. It's so, so heavy. heavy. I literally trip and fall, and I land face forward with my hands out. It's, I, the, the dog, mm. all I saw was a dog grabbed my wrist like this and literally the dog grabbed my wrist and would not let go. Yeah. I think from there is when my trajectory mm -hmm. of, of, of being on the show yeah. went down, down, yeah. down. I was ice... It was hell. It Do was you know bad. what killed me as well? Gary the medic knew that you were that damn bad, guys. He gave her this like... Club Tropicana yeah. special bandage, <laughs> you know, that was like really jazzy yeah. to make you it feel. It was so camp. It was yeah. the most camp bandage ever. It was, <laughs> it was like, but not. I mean, I might as well have been watching the TV on my wrist because it, yeah. it, it was that lively. It was, and they just, they just wrapped it around my arm and they were like. Girl, it get was, back so, in the house. Go on, carry so on, carry on, proceed. Yeah. Yeah. But th and this is what I mean. There is so much that people don't know. Yeah. Yeah. People only think that what's in the edit is our day. Oh. Yeah. And I'm like, I can't stress to you enough that there are 24 hours in this day and you've seen 40 minutes. Yeah. Like, so much goes on. I mean, the way that you felt with, with that dog bite is the way I felt from day one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You were in hell. She was, was in, in hell. hell. Yeah, she was. Like, she I was. just was so uncomfortable from day one. I just felt like my trajectory just go boom. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> no. I was like, get me was out Like, here. From, from arrival. <laughs> She's yeah, down. I made a mistake. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. at that minute, Shannon yeah. knew she fucked yeah, up. Yeah, I fucked up. Yeah, if I could go in and do it again with mm -hmm. all of you and not be in any pain from the beginning, I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Really? Do it again in a heartbeat. Hell no. If I could go must in, be nice. Must be I nice. don't agree. Good for you. <laughs> if I could go in, you like. That was a, such a horrible experience. No, it wasn't a horrible experience. I loved meeting you guys. And, like, mm -hmm. I had so much fun with you guys. But if I could just try again yeah. and be myself and go in and do it all again with you guys, I do would do it. Do you feel as though almost you didn't get a full, fair shot at it, at the experience because yeah. of that? Yeah, 100%. I just wasn't... I didn't feel, like, good. and Like, do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. like, it was just horrible. So I just... I loved meeting you guys. And if I could do it again with you guys and just mm -hmm. not... 
not be the way I was. I yeah. Yeah. I hate um, that. I hate it. Yeah. I hate it. Well, but also, I do think what I've seen of you has shown you in an amazing life. I agree. Yeah. I agree. Guys. So caring, just the most gorgeous, genuine soul. Like, oh. very much what I thought when I left or you. Like, yeah. that's exactly what I thought of you and I thought that's what was shown. Thanks. So I think you need to, like... Big up, no, I'll take it. I'll yeah, take it. I'll is take it? it? The comment section has <laughs> just changed. So, like, we take it. Do you know what Babe, I mean? let me tell you, if there's anything I've learned from this experience, obviously, I came up on TikTok. TikTok love chaos, right? Any, you could be as chaotic as yeah. you like, and people will be like, I am so here for this. Mm -hmm. YouTube... Different scary, spooky place. Different gravy. Oh my god! Yeah, I've, scary. I think it's so scary. <laughs> like the comments on there are so different. Yeah, to it's such a different space to exist in than you like TikTok is than all of it. It's People just, are much nicer on on TikTok. Like they're I just agree. much more like there's less. I I find there's mm. less hate on TikTok. Mm -hmm. I didn't. I've not really got like much hate, but like. People are definitely more to the point mm -hmm. and things on YouTube, 100%. Agreed. Agreed. Yeah. Is this this goes on YouTube? Um, yes. Yeah. So please, <laughs> please, sir, be nice. Fucking for fuck's sake. One of us. Yeah, in it. <laughs> um, also, your episode when you got evicted. Why was it so emotional? <laughs> Did you watch it? It was so, like... I don't know what it was. The whole thing was very emotional. Wasn't it? Yeah. I, I reacted to it. Yeah. And then as I'm editing, I'm crying again. Why you? <laughs> yeah. I, I've cried over that like three or four times now. Wow. Why do you think it was such an emotional moment? I, I think because like I was like, so I was probably done by like day three. Realistically, right. wasn't I? Fact. Like I was done by day three. Mm -hmm. And like, but I still grew to be so close to all of you mm. and loved you all so much when I left. But I was so also so happy to leave. Right. So that was, that was just like a lot of emotions, like a lot of mixed emotions mm -hmm. was just flying about. Yeah. So, yeah. It, it I was, totally get that. It was still, yeah, it was emotional. It was like, I don't know, I watched it back and I was like, oh my God, they've managed to make, but it actually felt that emotional it as did well. Feel, yeah. Even when you did leave. And I think probably so much of you feeling down bad, but you were going through so many peaks and troughs in that place. Yeah. Because mm. I remember, Joyce, you gave her big sister, like, unbelievable podcast extraordinaire speech, right? The fact they cut that out. The fact <laughs> they cut that out. When Joyce much to came, think about. Much to when on. Joyce came back in, you gave me the, the speech I needed, the words I needed to go for the next four days. Yeah. Wow. I, I, would have, I think I genuinely would have left if you hadn't come back in and given me that speech. Bro, like, I've never known a speech to go down that well. As in, it's literally like... I was telling everyone. Yeah. I, I like felt... Rejoice. You are so... Rejoice! <laughs> Rejoice! Get it? Joy. Uh, honestly, like, you really do have a way of words Incredible. with that kind of thing. It literally goes Martin Luther King, Joyce. Like, very much. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. You can't tell the difference. Like, you came downstairs and you were literally like... I was like, oh, fantastic. I'm ready, yeah. And I went, oh, wait. <laughs> I said, oh, all right. Who I is like, this? Are you okay? Do you need a hug? You literally went, no, oh, honestly, yeah, Joyce has just said exactly what I needed her to say. Yeah. I feel like because... Sometimes when you're in your own head, you see mm -hmm. your own perception of things. And I feel like, obviously, Shannon is a words of affirmation girly like me. Mm -hmm. And as an observer, I could see how she was growing day yeah. by day from where she first started to where I, I met her at that time. We had mm -hmm. a conversation. And I always think it's important to go back to your why. Like, why do you want to do this? And I felt mm -hmm. like Shannon had so much to prove to herself and to the world mm -hmm. that she is that motherfucking girl. Yeah. So as a friend, I just had to remind you that, girl, you <laughs> yeah. are that girl. Yeah. And why you came here is if you're not done yet. Mm -hmm. So let's put our hot, hot spanks on. So, yeah. Put <laughs> <our, our> <laughs> that on. gym gear on because we're all feeding for it. And get to work. Put yeah. it on and stop crying, literally. <laughs> and it was the same with me. Like, I feel like the, the, the friendship that the girls had, like, mm -hmm. I don't know what I would have done, me personally, mm -hmm. if I didn't have the support system of you guys in that house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because the relationship that we had was amazing where every time some bit, one person was down, everybody would circle around to, yes. to bring each other up. Mm -hmm. So I think by the end of it, like it, it was it was me, Ash and Casey, and Ash was the person that 
literally was my rock because mm -hmm. I got to your point mm -hmm. where it was like, I can't Take three, do, me. I can't, mm -hmm. do yeah. this. I can't do this anymore. Forget about the, the show itself, but mm -hmm. just being in a house yeah. and not being able to see the outside world. I've been bitten. I've been bruised. <laughs> yeah, I've, been damaged, I've got two, my, two of my nails have popped. Mm -hmm. I've got four lashes on my left right. eye. I've got nothing I've, left. I've got nothing, nothing left. left. Nothing left. I had nothing left to give. No. And Ash honestly carried me mm to the end of that show. I could not have no. done it without you. Honestly, mm. and I think one thing that so sets us apart as a cast this season, from what I've heard from everyone else, is there's never been a season where everyone has just loved each other. There's not. Yeah. And I mean, we I, literally, yeah. and it's not even like a, like a lie and we're just saying that for the, for the views or the, yeah. you know, we genuinely did. Yeah. And that's why when characters like Max came in, everyone was just like, honestly, you can't rock this boat. You actually can't. No. I don't know how, like, thank fuck I left. <laughs> <laughs> because genuinely, don't. I, 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 that, like, I genuinely think I would have just walked out. I could yeah. not have done it. I don't know how you guys it did it. It was hilarious. I don't know how they edited it, but it was so it was so awkward when he came in. The edit was awkward. The it, was, edit. it was as awkward as it felt. It was so painful because he yeah. was trying to give it and we were like, you ain't going to do my friend like that. No. Yeah. Like, you ain't going to do my girl Because like we were that. friends. And yeah. you know so, what? Yeah. We were all so disheveled by that point. We'd just done a challenge. So <laughs> we've all got out. Everybody's just in that space where they're trying to pick themselves up mm -hmm. and get a bit of energy. And yeah. we were all just so over it by Down this point. And all we hear is... <sighs> <laughs> and I just... Honestly, <laughs> Gollum... <laughs> From from the other corner of the room, I went, nah. No. Nobody no. gave a rat. Was Everyone fun. was just like this. Yeah. And he's chatting, and I know his whole thing was to come in and rattle us and shake yeah. a few feathers, but we were so done by that point. And you can see it in the edit. In the edit, yeah. You can we see were it. Tired. Every, tired. Everyone's like this. Everybody wanted to go. <gasps> yeah. Home. Everybody was over it. Yeah. Then you've now come to come and be breathing. It's yeah. Just like, just yeah. 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 To come and yeah. Yeah. from yeah. I can't. Yeah. I don't know what <laughs> to say. Bad. Yeah. It was yeah. so funny. But yeah, I do agree. Like, it was so nice that we all just had each other's backs Agreed. in that sense. Yeah. I mean, there was days where Joyce, by the end, Shan, if you had seen us, it was one day Joyce would cry. Or like in the morning, Joyce would cry. I'd pick her up. By the evening, I'd go to Joyce, floods of tears. Yeah. I'm in hell. She'd be like, okay, I'm actually feeling quite good, so I'll pick you up. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was literally... It was yoga. like, yeah. The, 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 the evening, Ash would be... <laughs> in the toilet, crying. And if, you know what's the funniest thing about Ash? When Ash cries there, she does this thing where she gets a wipe here, yeah, she'll be like... <laughs> and she'll remove all her makeup just so she can cry properly. Yes. And it kills me every time. I hate oh crying God. with a full face beat. Because so that's... Good. I didn't put a full face beat on today to do this. Yeah. So yeah. I'm like, let me remove it right now. Yeah. So I, you're she'll, so right. I'm like this. She'll remove, she'll remove her makeup and just so she can cry harder. It's so funny. It's like, you got let it go. And then in the morning, I should be like, do you know what? Yeah, I feel good today. And I'm like, same. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> same. I'm and like, her voice is just quivering and I'm like, okay, do you need me? To the She's toilet. Like, yeah. yeah. And then we're, literally I'll just burst into tears and then I'll be fine. And then in the evening, I just like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like a push and pull. It, it is. Was. Push and pull. It really was. That, that one morning in specific. Wait, guys. wait, wait. No, talk about you. Guys. Have, you wait, have to talk about when producer Tom came in? Um, did producer Tom come in at this point? He came in in the afternoon. Yeah, in he did, afternoon. yeah. Uh, this one morning, I don't know what happened. Joyce woke up full of beans. And I remember thinking, thank God, because I'm going to try and like take some of that energy because I feel like rat sauce yeah. this morning. And I don't know why. So I just, you know, from the minute you wake up, you want to cry. Yeah, yeah. And you are just fighting the tears and fighting the tears. And I said, all I want is to gym. If my batty is right and tight, I'm going to feel 10 times better. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've just woken up before everyone else. You know how we tried yeah. every day yeah. to work out and there's yeah. no time. I got to the little gym area. There's there's two dumbbells. It was trash. I get to the gym area. I picked up the dumbbell. There's tears already forming. No. I go to do one squat. The sound and camera guys come in and say, sorry, Ash, you've not got time for this. I'm going to mic you up now. I, when I took, guys, I'm going to do an impression of what I did. I went, <gasps> okay, do you want to <laughs> I am squatting mid tip. I'm like this. All right, no worries. Can you just, <laughs> can you just put it on right now? And while I'm doing this, he was, he felt so, he just thought, oh my God, 
We are torturing these yeah. individuals. My girl is crying and squatting, and squatting. at the yeah. same yeah. time. Yeah. It was. And you know what? One thing I love about Ash, and she's very <laughs> different to me because I hate that when I'm in that mood and I'm sad, it's in my aura. You can mm. feel when I'm down. Mm. It's in my face. Same. It's in my energy. Mm -hmm. That morning, <laughs> me and Ash woke up. We stayed in the bed together. Yeah. I think you were in Casa del Ash at this point. Yes. And we were laughing, 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 having a good time. We had, we had coffee together, yeah. sipping, sipping, sipping. Not up to 15 minutes later, I finished my coffee. <laughs> and then the food's like, oh, Ash needs you upstairs. And I've walked upstairs and you were in <laughs> floods of tears. I thought you hurt yourself during your gym workout because that's where I left you. <laughs> I thought you, you'd broken your knee. Your no, no, to the point where... Yeah, because I... Yeah, and you know I am an energies kind of person. So yeah. for me, if I'm feeling low... All I need to do is hang out with my friends, my yeah. people mm -hmm. that are in high spirits. Mm -hmm. Immediately, I'm, I'm like, oh, the world has been put to rights again. Yeah. So I was fighting it and fighting it the whole day. And I just saw the mic man and I just said, drop me the <laughs> fuck, fuck out of this building. <laughs> you didn't let me even do 10 squats. <laughs> what? I've not got time for 10 squats. I said, I can't do it. I went upstairs and I remember just going from the balcony, Joyce. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she came up, she went, you all right, babe? And I was like this. <laughs> Honestly, she literally, it was like wailing. an explosion. And that was like, what? You went, what happened? I said, what, what happened? You went, I just had coffee with you and I, I left you to your work. And we were giggling and laughing. Like, literally, it, it was crazy. But that's the eternal pro. That was the eternal, like, that's the house. battle. But they bring, this is the thing, like, in the house as well, they bring you up, mm -hmm. like, with a win. Yeah. And then they bring you crashing back down with, yeah. like, an eviction. That's what it is. And, like, they bring you up with, and it feels like when you're watching it, it doesn't feel like it's massive highs and massive mm -hmm. lows. But even when you win, watching your, and it's so bizarre, like, watching your friend in jail, <laughs> like, you know, it's not real jail. But like watching a friend in jail, just like in solitary, like it's just it's just shit. Makes you feel bad. Yeah, it's like you never feel that good. Yeah, literally. It, like it's so weird. Like they're right there. Do you, Do you know, know what, I mean? what was killing but... me? The, <laughs> the challenge when you had that challenge to tidy, and Casey <laughs> had the <laughs> bro, and Casey was <laughs> Casey's job was to mess it up. I have never been more confused. <laughs> me and Joyce were going. What the fuck's going on here? You all of a sudden, Mary Puppet, <laughs> like this in the bedroom. What do you mean? So like, I, I was tidy. I was the tidiest one in there. You were, but you were. like, but like to, yeah. to like a mad degree that particular morning. Yeah. I, was, I would okay. never make somebody's bed. I would never ever make somebody else's right. bed. Right, and I yeah. knew by this point, we were all getting a bit jarred at how messy the boys were, X, Y, Z. So we were just like, okay, Shannon's really giving it today. <laughs> She's giving it beans. Cool, that's nice. Casey. Mattressing, <laughs> pouring water on the floor, like. And then I was like, okay, somebody's <clears throat> on a secret challenge, but who? Yeah. Are you on a challenge to clean? Is Casey on another challenge to piss everyone off? Is no one on a challenge and this is actually all going to pot? Yeah. yeah. We, I couldn't work I it out. I didn't know it was a Honestly, I'm very Delulu. I didn't know it was a challenge. <laughs> I swear to God, that never came to me that that was a secret challenge because Shannon is always someone that she always is like, bruv, this house is disgusting. Yes. Yeah, it was gross. Every yeah. time she's like, what is it? And she tries to clean and then mess up again. Mm -hmm. And Casey, like, everybody sees daytime Casey, but no one has seen nighttime, nighttime Casey. Nighttime Casey is a different Casey yeah. is a chaotic queen. So yes. that to me, was like, oh, nighttime cases come to play in the day. Yeah, 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 yeah. fabulous. Yeah. So I didn't know it was a challenge. <laughs> and then especially when Shadow bugged out, I said this, I didn't know, I was like, this can't be a challenge. Right, see, then I felt bad because I went, Nah, I know exactly what's happening here. Shannon's on a challenge. Then I stopped consoling you because I thought, get fucked, this is a crocodile kid. <laughs> Go away. Then I saw you upstairs shaking in your boots. I went, Oh my god! I don't know what's real, what's not, yeah. what's my name. Don't know anything anymore. Yeah. It, was it was it was hell. And I thought it was George or Danny on a mission. You, what they cut out is Danny fucking pouring cereal on the floor. Danny yes, literally got his was. cereal. Remember? I thought it was da Danny. Oh yeah. So I go, he goes, I pour some floor. I go, I dare you. Go on, I dare you. Did that not make the edit? No. And he just Guys. goes. And I thought, you fucker, you're on a mission. He, yeah, he literally he poured, did, he literally he ate it down just and poured it on the floor. And then he ate it off the floor, <laughs> by did. the way. He did. And I think that's what set you off. Yeah. yeah. That's what, that is what set you off. Yeah. Because yeah. He, you just finished sweeping that floor. Yeah. Yeah. And then, it's interesting yeah. what, they, what they cut out. Much to ponder on. Much to ponder on. Much to on. Um, can we also discuss us being taken for massive, massive idiot? By you, you are in that <laughs> fake argument. Oh my Joyce. god! They cut out my twenty minutes of history. 
Honestly, no, 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 honestly, guys. Let's talk about it. Let's talk. It was insane. Let's talk what about I it. What I learned in that time was <laughs> a madness. Valuable lessons for life. Did they cut out the Black History? They cut out my Black History. I'm yeah. so no, I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad because honestly, no, guys. Wait, first of all, Foo said that you have a budding career in Nollywood, which has been killing yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. Did that make the cut? Did that make the cut? I don't know, but I if it know. didn't, it's here now. Yeah. Because you do. I genuinely, and Joyce, this is what was so weird to me because I know you to that extent. So I was like, I would know if Joyce was on a challenge because I feel like I'm so but close to you by this so much point. Of it. You missed so no, much of the fact that No, this is what they didn't put in here. I heard the arguments start to happen while I was upstairs. Well, you couldn't not hear it. And I was there. looking at the cameras, going, doing typical Ash. I was going... Because <laughs> I thought you were just having a little spat. And I yeah. thought, let me hear what this is about. And I was going like this, on the balcony. Then I heard your voice raise and I thought... <sighs> fuck, this isn't a joke, this is a real argument. <laughs> I hear George go, Ash, help me out. Yeah. I went, Ash, George is like screaming, Ash, yeah. Ash. And then I went, oh no, something's kicking off. Yeah. I came downstairs and that's when I just saw you like a pressure cooker go and I thought, nah, this is real. That's what was insane as well is during lunch when we're not filmed, you're, you're still playing it. Yeah. She, she's coming to me, she's going, George, George, yeah, George is pissing, George is me, pissing off. me off. George is still playing up to it throughout with the whole time we're not even being filmed. <laughs> you were just winding us up, ready to fucking I need explode. I to see my hair, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I need to see my hair. And the way you came back looking insane. Babe, a million dollars. Yeah. It was Annoyed so, me more, I, it was like Made in Manhattan, <laughs> that, that scene where she comes, where J-Lo comes out and she's been all doled up to the nines at the, dress, at the hairdressers. Oh. Never seen anything like it. Insane. It was, that was, that was such, a, it was my, it was my one and only challenge I, I got to do and we were so shit at challenges. Yes. We never won. Sucked. And yeah. it was even because we did it too early. Like, somebody will have a challenge and then 10 minutes later, they're just acting like a whole new person. And it's like, girl, <laughs> yeah. be fucking for real. So I was like, if I have to play this, these are some intelligent people in this house. Mm -hmm. I have to play it well. Mm -hmm. So I told George in the morning, but I was like, don't react now. When, I'm re when it's time, we'll, we'll have it cracking. Cool. Was, it, was your idea the wig? Yeah, my idea was the wig. Because you knew. It wasn't George's, was it? It was my yeah, idea. Yeah, <laughs> Fair. I, was, I, I knew that if I was going to play this right, yeah. I would have to do something that would actually proper trigger me that in real bang. life. Yeah. So I was like, what would trigger me in real life? And I was like, okay, cool. This makes sense. So mm -hmm. I was like, George. Would right. you act like that in real life? I would, girl. <laughs> no. no. I would never do that. I would, no. ne I would never, never react like that in real life. No. Not, not to that level over the week. Do you know what? But you'd be pissed off. Of course I'd be pissed yeah. off. Yeah. That yeah, would yeah, yeah, piss yeah, me yeah. off. That would piss me off, but not to the level where, I, like, it was so dra dramatic. I was holding the wig and I was shaking it. Like, am I a dickhead? Am I fucking out? Am I fucking out? Am I am I fucking out? <laughs> oh my God. That. Joyce, and you know what the worst thing was as well? All we wanted to do was be there for you as friends. Yeah. In my head, I'm I was thinking, she's fucked it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> same. Was you actually... But I was thinking, shit, man, I hope that she cut... Because I was so scared that you were going to go home yeah. and leave on that. Yeah, and same. And I was thinking, oh, my God, she can't. Like, she can't, she's, she's fucked it. Yeah. She's fucked it. She's yeah. fucked it. It's it... so funny because even after the fight, when I came out and I saw some of the comments, people were like... Oh, I feel so sorry for George. And I'm like, girl, why? It was, a it was a challenge. What? It was a challenge. Oh. Also, Tennessee's going, George, you're cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> George, you're done. <laughs> so, guys, no, guys, the 20 minutes of black history that came with that challenge was Hilarious. the fucking funniest thing. So, George is running around, obviously, me unknowingly, he's running around in full actor mode. Yeah. He's running around, I don't get it, I don't get it. I went, oh my God, I must step up. I must, as a this brown, is my time. I said, as a brown girl, I must do my thing here, <laughs> otherwise I'm done. And I said, what do I say? How do I say it in the most right way that I don't get, like... Educated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You explained it to me about 20 minutes. George walks in, I go, George, you need to listen to what Ash has to say here. It's so, really important. That. <laughs> yeah, you need to listen. Shannon went, can you just explain to George what you were explaining explain. to me? Yeah. I went, bum, but clock. I went... <laughs> So what it is about black women and wigs. And then he just went on I'm and on and on. You. Oh my That's days. So and the fact that all of that was for a fucking challenge. And most of it was cut. 
Yeah. Mad. It was no, bro. I, it was fab. I'm so glad. Like even even when they when they put the episode out, they had they had cut us to that section, and everybody was like, "Oh my god!" I had that George's brother even message yes the producers to be like, "What the hell is going because. on?" Because like, yeah. that's that fair. So that's funny. killing me. Okay, I've just pushed it back another half an hour. I love this. Time. I love this for you. They can wait. Um. Okay. Who's have- going to see? Oh, shut up. I'll tell you later. <laughs> We are the cheeky girls. You know, guys, that was our thing in there that yeah. we called ourselves the, the cheeky, cheeky girls. Cheeky girls. Hot, hot, naughty, and cool. Guys, hot, no. naughty. Hot, naughty. Hot, On sexy. that note, did you see Philly's reaction video? Because me and Joyce were dying no, at it. No. He's done a reaction, and we knew we were like, I bet they are going to do a madness with that edit. You know when he came in and then and the whole thing was what's the population of this and we had a quiz yeah. trivia and then that clip of me and Joyce just going mad saying why didn't you dress didn't us you dr- in, the, yeah, in, the, in yeah, hot and naughty that, leggings that, yeah. so I could say what's the population of this <laughs> massive he he loved it did he he, he, he ate that up he bounced on the did. chair he bounced on the chair <laughs> he jumped on the chair he went what he jumped on the chair for you he went what all this what? for me I never knew I never knew that. What? For me? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. No, as if he doesn't know. It, it, this Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, he jumped on, he said, all this for me? Yeah. It Y'all are jumping on the chair so for me? funny. He was bouncing around his room. I was like, I knew that they would make a funny edit I mean, you're this. single, he's single. What are you saying? He what? was... He was <laughs> Me? Me? Yeah. I never knew that. What? You were Philly. I mean, what? you were you were jumping. You were shaking. He was jumping. I think that could be a fun and little. This is the thing. <laughs> it is. Right. I'm, I'm a matchmaker. Swiftly moving on. <laughs> no, we could bring it back. We can circle back. We can bring. Yeah, we, yeah. we, we, we might circle back. back. Like, I mean, back. Philly, like it's giving dinner date or what? Like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, why? Philly, do you want to go on a dinner date? Yes or no? Nah? <laughs> Speak now or forever hold your peace. Come on, bad girl. Hot, <laughs> Listen, and cool. all I've got to say is looks may fade, but laughter, that, life, that lasts a lifetime. Per. Okay? Period. Per. Per. Tell him. Yeah. Per. And he did say that he was like, nah, you're I hot. need to say that line again because I fumbled yeah. it. So. Philly. <laughs> looks, may... <laughs> <laughs> looks may fade, but laughter, that lasts a lifetime, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hot and naughty. Hot and naughty. <laughs> um, and okay. take one for all they know. Oh, and this is yeah. it. This In is one it. take. This is killing me. You ain't going to die long, girl. <laughs> I got you. Um, food challenge. Quickly. Ooh. Ash. Ash. I have to address the food challenge. Okay. Did you watch it? I've seen clips, but I haven't watched it. But Bro, I, I, I heard about it on the day. Ash. Helen Horror. A cow's tongue. A raw onion. A raw onion. A cow's tongue. It was, do you know what? Some of the worst stuff. Yeah. No, the fish eyes was the, fish is the, is the one that you <gasps> malfunctioned on. You come. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> the fish eyes, a crunch. It was crunch. It, it was like, you know, it's like the scales, it was in the eye. So when you crunched it, you can feel like the cartilage. It was the worst. Do you worst know how thing. bad I felt as well? Because we lost that challenge. So we got in the challenge area, saw all these little trays, and I said, oh, here we go. We are going to have to eat. It's a bush took a trial. Yeah. And then they said, no, no, the winners are going to be eating to save you. And honest one, immediate thought was, thank fuck. <laughs> <laughs> then I thought, oh, my God, my sis Joyce, she's going to be in hell, and you were. Do you know what it is? I can't it, believe how well you did, though. Do you know, I'll be honest, do you know what it is? And a lot of people thought, during that that time in the last episode, people mm. thought, oh my God, Joyce is really, really competitive at this time. But do you know what it was? I did not, I could not cope with you go, with it, with you gone. But like, a, a reason to be competitive. Agreed. I agree. That's, a, that's like the perfect reason Great to be incentive. competitive. Great yeah. incentive. When, when I was like, Ash has to win this, it wasn't so much all this other stuff that people are talking about. Yeah. It's because... 
I don't know how I would have mentally and mm-hmm. yeah. functioned in the house yeah. if you were gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And maybe Babe, you were eating those fish eyes. Like, I'm doing this for my mentals. No, I yeah. was banging. I was like, nah, Ash cannot. In all circumstances, Ash cannot go home because you will find me in a corner in a sand. Yeah. I would turn into sand. Sand. Because it was... Shannon, I know. It was, it was, it was, it was yeah. so hard by I know. that point. It I was mean, so you, hard. you fake left on what day four? Yeah, day I fake four. Left on day four. Yeah, and that was that was that was hard enough. Like that was like, oh shit, like this is gonna go down the shitter. And then when you came back, it was like the best day ever. But like <laughs> day right. whatever, day ten, having your rock leave. Yeah. No, I couldn't have done it. No, couldn't have done it. I was like, I can't. So yeah, I, I would do that for you. In a heartbeat, any I should go. I love you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe no. I would. I would, I would <laughs> Maybe do that again. again because I I really did need you. But that food challenge was one of the worst things I've ever done in my life. Do you know did what? You see the way I was screaming, babe. Nah. It, yeah. There's a clip of you screaming. You're just completely malfunctioning. <laughs> then foo with this crazy eyes. Did you see foo with this crazy <laughs> eyes? All of a sudden, just looks dead to camera like this and goes. <laughs> I've never seen Jesus. anything like it. It was. And the worst thing was as well, <laughs> Fu was creating a narrative about every animal that he was eating. Yeah. So <laughs> he, yes, so he, he looked say at, this cow could have given a blowjob to another cow. Babe. He's, he's not wrong. And he's, he's not crazy. wrong. But his tongue was long though. But the story he created in his head... It was as if this was the slaggiest cow in the meadow. <laughs> she's been doing lineups all day and now she's landed it on, on this plate. plate. Yeah. And now I have to eat it. <laughs> Mad. Like it was absolute. And I was like, Foo, stop creating the narrative around the animal. Sharp and eat the tongue. Yeah. yeah. Just eat it. Yeah. He was. Nah. <clears throat> Foo was killing me. It was, like you said, the crazy eyes. Like I looked to my right <laughs> and Foo was looking at Danny like this. Shaking. It was the shaking from his. Yeah, yeah. And Daddy just that. Oh. oh. I was like, and are you? Oh no, not this going again. Oh, Hang on. No. Oh, we're in hell. Um. <laughs> and Tanny, Tanny kept going. Boo! Stop <laughs> looking at me. <laughs> I've never seen such eye contact in my life. It was life. just this. It was. Oh it my was god! So funny, it, and his face was shaking, and his nose was running. Like, yeah. George was just cool as a cucumber. He was in some sort of med- meditation somewhere. I mean, George dies. For George the was boys. doing it for Danny, wasn't yes, he? Yeah, so like, as in he would lay his life down yeah. for Danny Aaron. So One I was like, percent. of course, this is a walk in the park. Anything, yeah, yeah. Fair play. You could have he stuck just thought, anything in front of him. He would have ate. Oh, babe, it. He, I mean, he's already sucking Danny's dick. Yeah, so exactly. that was, this is what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. He, he said brain smoothie. See if I care. Yeah. <laughs> he didn't care. He did it not was care. Absolute madness that challenge. So hell. Babe. So so hell. Um, thank you so much. Did they show me vomiting? I was I you vomit? was I vomited. Did they show you vomiting? I'm not well, sure. Well, I hope not because at least let, let me preserve my dignity. I agree. I, I agree. was the sick. amount of vomit she and shit really that went sick. around that house is insane. It's like in that's, the 14 days. That, that's that's not not like normal. The first four days we just kept talking about shit. All we talked about was poo. All we talked about was poo. You didn't poo for what five days? I, I didn't, didn't poo for six days. The first five days, me and Shannon didn't poo. Didn't poo. And I pooed the day you left. It was like a stress poo. Yes. Yes, no, you did, you did. Your and we were like, God, down 50%. Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 That's so funny. So mm. big, big Daddy Aaron said that whenever you talk about poo, your views go down by a certain percentage. <laughs> and that was what Mr. Beast said, apparently. That's from Mr. Beast. Really? Like, right. Yeah. Everyone that's... needs to get a grip, Just, we I poo. think. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, we're going to end this gorgeous, gorgeous chat off yeah. with a little snog barrier void. <gasps> I know, <laughs> this is Shannon's worst nightmare. I'm, you know my answers. Yeah. Because yeah. you saw me do it. Yeah. So I need the answers from you guys. Okay. You go. Housemate boys? Yes. <laughs> I would say I'd marry stars. Yeah. I think stars are such a sweetheart. Mm-hmm. I feel like um, what, was sh- what was shown mm-hmm. on camera mm-hmm. does not equate to how much of a beautiful oh, soul he doesn't. is. Oh, it doesn't. It really in. doesn't. He didn't get enough airtime, no. that man. He didn't at all. He didn't. Like, somebody give Stars his flowers because yeah. he was such a glue in our group, I thought. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He didn't have to be the loudest in the room. He didn't no. have to be anything. Yeah. Stars is just stars. And his little comments about foo. Yeah. In, yeah, I loved it. Don't. He was the best. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Who would I snog? <laughs> Thank <sighs> you.
I would stalk Danny Aaron's. Yeah, period. Because Danny Aaron's, I love him. He is so naughty. <laughs> And if you guys in the house, he was he was naughty, cool, and fun, and very yeah. very friendly. I think he'd be. A, I think he, me, and him would would try our best. Because yeah. <laughs> we'd try not, our not, best. Not for Mary, but a little snob. Well, a little snob. Fine, I mean, yeah. my mouth is quite big, and his is quite small, so I don't know how that's gonna work. Yeah. But if it if, it, make happens, it, if there's a person to make it work, yeah, I would. And make I'll it probably work. swallow him. But <laughs> <I> agree. <laughs> but what's wrong with but that? What's wrong with that? What's wrong with that? <laughs> All right, George. I would avoid. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Um, I think same as you. I would probably avoid George. Yeah. Now I love George. Yeah. But I feel like little brother. Yeah, it's definitely little little brother. He's so attractive. Mm-hmm. He's so hot and cool. Mm-hmm. But definitely in Don't the house, you're giving little brother. Yeah. George in the morning though. Me and Joyce had a chat about this. Sorry, I saw a comment saying um, George shirtless. When did I? George wasn't. I didn't see George shirtless. Every morning. morning. Sorry, am I blind? I didn't every, see George shirtless. Oh, best believe I was watching. I had a front row seat. Every morning I went, Gosh. hello, morning, guys. <laughs> I can't, every morning. Because, because, I've got a girlfriend now. She yeah, went, I've got a girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, yeah. It, 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 I've got a girlfriend. <laughs> but I'm not going to lie. George shirtless is a his, moment. His body's wow. good. It is. His body's good. Nice yeah. tan. Yeah. Nice broad shoulders. And he works out. He's yeah, he that does guy. work out. He wow. does have a great body. But every also, morning, little, little brother. So boxers, mm, tights. Yeah. But it was little one brother. of them. Yeah. My man's telling me no. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'd look at it and I'd go, no, fuck. Babe, it was with 14 no. days. I did. I'm just telling you. Yeah. I looked straight. You know? oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like food. I was looking straight. <laughs> good morning, Joyce. Good morning. No. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Like, oh, my God. Don't I'm a, kill I'm a me. Yeah. Has to be. Okay. Okay. God mine, does this. mine would be, <laughs> I would snog Star. Yeah. I'd mani- marry Darren. Da- what? Sorry. Ma- <laughs> Manny Darren. Yes. Sorry. I'd marry Danny. <laughs> yeah. And I would avoid food because... Sorry, did you hear how much that man farted in the house? First. I couldn't get away from his asshole. Yeah, like, that's genuinely. what I said about George. Look, I found it yeah. with Danny. Yeah. Not with, with Fu, sorry. Yeah. He, his farting left, right and centre. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and also, master manipulator. Master You'd manipulator. You'd never know what was the truth or not. You wouldn't know what was coming Can we? You. Can we address that thing? What? Remember when he told us to say happy birthday to Sharky and Nico? Don't tell me it wasn't their birthday. It wasn't their motherfucking birthday. <laughs> You know, it wasn't their motherfucking birthday. And he was like, guys, you know, on the outside world, it's Sharky and Nico's he birthday. He went, on the count of three, had us all And that there. was like, happy birthday. <laughs> Wait, what day was this? This was, I can't remember what day. I, just, I, don't think she, I don't think she was there. I think you were Because we did it for my then. little sister's birthday. Yes, we did. We did. We, we, we did. Birthday yeah, September, which obviously wasn't lies and Which wasn't lies. And that was. We were with passion. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. And I thought, Lie. this is making the edit. It's them two. And it did. Yeah. Lie did them it? A, lie them a blood clot. Oh, <laughs> it's not, it was none of their birthdays. He is so... Liar. He's terrible. Liar. He is a menace. Yeah, he's a he menace. Is. Honestly, food stories are so... Because there's like stuff that you wouldn't usually lie about. <laughs> yeah. Food will tell you it's the truth. So you'll be like, With okay. dead straight face. Yeah. Dead straight, dead straight face. Dead straight like, face. Oh, that's it. The guys lied on It's lie. something that's not worth lying about. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. everyone's like, oh, sweet. Fair enough. And yeah. then two days later, we go... Oh, that was a lie. Yeah, it's a lie. That's, that's a so, lie. No, he's, he's so, so funny. funny. No, yeah. He's really the best. But avoid, yeah. Avoid. Her. Fair. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Girlies, thank you so much for coming. Thanks Thank for you. Having you. Oh, I love you all. Love you. you what a time we've had, you man. What, what, what a time. You. What a time to be and alive. And it's only just begun. In it. <laughs> and we still need to go out because we haven't done the locked in reunion yet. Oh. So we're... Oh. At, Oh, 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 the so reunion. We are going out live and direct, yeah. shaking it up. I'm going to so do excited. everything you girls taught me in that house. But, babe, I'm, <laughs> I'm shaking Hoochie everything mamas. you got. Hoochie mamas. Listen, the Hoochie Mamas are out to play. It is. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all socials. Give me five stars if you love it. If you don't, well, I don't give a rat. <laughs> tell your mum, tell your dad, tell your nan, tell your dog. Love me, lips me. Thank you so much for joining me. I love you all. Mwah! Woo!